Hello guys, another new MJ video, Michael Jackson himself at the This Is It Staples Center doing the rehearsals for the O2. MJ is with his singers and dancers here for the performance of the O2 Arena that will kick off in July. But uh, that did not happen for all of us. But we did get the This Is It DVD where Michael Jackson was rehearsing and singing his dance his dance um, heart out for his fans because he was so looking forward of doing the shows and you know I've watched the This Is It many times and to tell the truth guys it is really really good um, Michael Jackson and his singers as dancers you know you know talking about this I know you guys already know, but this is Michael Jackson that did this, is it, in 2009. And he only had like three weeks to kick off at the O2. He only had like three weeks to go, guys. That's what really, really, really pisses me off. Do you know what I mean, guys? That's what really pisses me off. Because there was going to be a 3D thriller. There was going to be this. There, were, there was going to be that. There was just going to be everything. He, uh, you guys have no idea what he has, what he has planned for you guys and fans. You had no idea, you know. I mean, when you really think, when you really watch it, this is it. You know the DVD. You know, just imagine what that was, what that would look like if you, if we really got to see Michael Jackson rehearsing doing all those shows. You know, it would have looked absolutely fucking fantastic. It was, you know, it would have looked, it, it would have been out of this world. It would have been. It would have been out of this history. It would have just destroyed every album and every fucking music hits in history. You know what I mean? It just would have been fucking amazing. The, I mean, a three D thriller. I would have loved to seen that. You know what I mean? I would. I mean, the original thriller will always be the best one. You know, but the three D thriller would have been amazing. I mean, like I have a three D TV, Samsung fifty inch smart TV. And I've watched the um. The, there's only a bit of it. It shows you of Michael Jackson's. This is uh a, three D thriller, and to tell you the truth, guys, it looked absolutely amazing, but it only shows you a bit of it. It doesn't show you the whole thing because Michael Jackson never got the chance to finish it off, and that what really pisses me off because of that stupid bastard Conrad Murray stopped him from doing it. Stupid cunt. I mean, all he had to do was not give him the proof of all. Michael Jackson would have been still here today, if he would have fucking dialed the fucking nine one one call quick enough. Michael Jackson would have been alive today. You know what I mean? And why did he not fucking phone the ambulance right away? You know what I mean? Why did he not? I don't fucking get it. You know, he was able to fucking call on the phone to separate callers, wasn't he? To his fucking girlfriends. I think he was just doing it to abandon Michael Jackson because he knew Michael Jackson would be lying there in a state. You know, guys, I know too much, you know, and the more I go on, the more you guys will go, my God, where the hell do I get all my good talking from? Well, guys, I'm going to cool it down now because the more I talk on, the more I can give out too much information about this because sometimes I have like a sense of what really happened on that day and in that room. Because the only two people who were there was Dr. Conor Murray and Michael Jackson. And I would like to know what really happened. But it just gives me a sense of my own mind of what I think what really happened. You know what I mean, guys? And if you guys want me to do a video of that there, then tell me, tell me and I'll do it. Because the way I can talk about things and the way I can talk about, you know, the way I see stuff. I mean, I can just talk about it and so people can understand it and what I mean. And people can really, really like of what I'm saying because of because I know too much do you know what I mean that's the thing guys that's why I had to cool down there because I was getting a bit frustrated there because if if he if the Dr. Murray wouldn't have call, called if he would have called 911 quick enough if he would have give the 911 call the name it's Michael Jackson I mean how old is he like I mean duh I mean who cares about the fucking age the guy is Michael Jackson do you know what I mean Michael Jackson would have been alive if Dr. Murray wasn't on, on those phone cyber callers. He is guilty. There's no way he is innocent. Even I can't even see he's innocent. 
there's no way he's not going to get away with this. And if he does, then he's a fucking slime ball because we all know he's guilty, guys, and he's never going to get out of it. He's never going to get out of it. Trust me, guys, he'll never get out of it. I promise you guys that he'll never get out of it. You know what I mean? Because there's just too much case against him. The case is an open, close case now, you know? He's guilty, and that's that. Once you're guilty, that's it. You know what I mean, guys? I mean, manslaughter, it should have been murder. It should have been murder. You know what I mean? Because there's just so much I can talk about Michael Jackson's death and, and everything else, you know? And, you know, I can just get really hyped up with what I'm saying. And you guys would enjoy me talking about MJ. I swear to God, guys, you have no idea. Once I get started about talking about things, I get I become really, really good at it. You know what I mean, guys? But every time when I look at this picture of MJ, that this is it with his, with his dancers and singers, it just really annoys me because, I mean, I've seen pictures of MJ and the, at Staples Center till the day that he died, and he was, and he just looked happy. He looked that he was ready. He knew that his fans would enjoy it. He knew that it just just it really annoys me, guys. You guys know what I mean. So, guys, that's all I really have to say for this video because. You mean because the more I the more I want to talk about, it, I want to save it for the next video and that there. Do you know what I mean, guys? So you guys can enjoy of what I'm saying. If you guys think I'm right, then hit thumbs up and let me know in the comments if you guys think that I'm really good at talking about things because I'm really good at talking about this. You know what I mean, guys? And to all the haters, you could dislike the video all you want because no one cares and I don't care. So, so guys. And fans and the believers keep believing Michael Jackson, keep the faith, believe in MJ. And then I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching yet again, guys. Peace out.